Jizz gang. Hey, Jizz gang. Can you hear me? Jizz gang. Hey, Jizz gang. Can you hear? Today we're going to be doing some backyard science. So we're going to be seeing how citric acid and baking soda react with water and oil. Uh, we're going to be doing it in the martini glass, because why not? And hopefully it's going to be super fun. So here it is, and let's see how it goes. First we need baking soda. About a teaspoon of baking soda. Baking soda. Chuck it in there. I don't know if that's too much. Oh my god. Okay. And then we want some, some amazing, super scientific exploder. That is citric acid. Citric acid. We're going to put that in. A little bit more. Okay. We're going to go with a red colour tablet. And this is purely for effect. Uh, you could use food dye as well. Uh, so red one. Pop that in there. Gonna mix it all up. Okay. Now that that's all nice and mixed up. Ah! Time to add the water. Whoa. Whoa. I want to I want something that's gonna fit down that. So I'm going to just use a handy dandy stick that I found in my backyard. So, oh, it broke. Add a little bit more water. And, um, a paintbrush, paintbrush. Found one. So that's gonna get in there and hopefully get all the bits we need it to get. Okay, I'll just add the rest of the water. Ooh. Okay. Now I want to try something a little bit different. Uh, instead of using a colour tablet, these thingies, we're going to be using red cabbage juice powder. Red cabbage juice powder. Uh, and just so it doesn't, or hopefully, so it doesn't get mucked up in there, or stuck in there, and the reaction work, doesn't work. I'm going to put the uh, vegetable oil in first, and I'm going to just fill it up to where the neck of this glass is. Okay. Might do something different as well, like um, the powders may react. So. I want to start off with some cabbage juice powder, red cabbage juice powder, and I just want to, I reckon a little bit, just a little bit will do, okay, maybe a little bit more. <laughs> okay. 
Hmm. I think I'm gonna start with bicarb soda. Bake no baking soda, sorry. Baking soda. I think I'm gonna start with baking soda. Okay. Nice. And it's floating, it's doing exactly what I wanted it to do. Just have to go grab some water, but yes, so that's doing exactly what it's supposed to do. I'm gonna just mix it in a tiny little bit. Okay. Yum. Okay, that is acting a little differently than expected. Uh, milky! Okay. Now for the citric acid. We're going to put a decent amount in there. Okay. I think I'm going to do this. Okay, so it's a lot thicker than anticipated. But... We'll put the water in and see what happens. It is expanding. Okay, alrighty. Oop. It seems to be expanding a lot more than the other ones, but we can't, the other one, but we can't see. Whoop. We can't see the oil as much as we can in, whoop, in this one. As you can, you may be able to see the oil on top. Whoop. But yeah, that was pretty cool. If we add some more citric acid to this red one that didn't go as bubbly. It looks like champagne, like it's doing some bubbly effects, just like champagne. So I don't know if the cabbage juice thickens, makes it thicker, or what has happened here, but the top of it is a lot thicker. Okay guys, so I've tipped what was in this cup all into this cup. Uh, what I did before the video started was I put a bunch of polymers, which are these things, in some blue water and food dye. And a proportion of this bag has turned into this lovely, lovely, lovely stuff. So. I just want to put it in there, put it in here, and whoop, whoop. There's actually a lot more water that hasn't been soaked up that I wasn't expecting. And as you can see, it's still floating on top of the oil that is left kind of clogged in there from last time. But I'll just put some more in. It 
it kind of looks like a slushy of some type. Like it looks like ice, even though it's just this squishy, absorbent scientific material. So yeah, that's blue food dye, water, and polymers sat over time. Probably about an hour for it to get this big. But there's still much more. Well, that's all the science I have time for today. Okay, just gang, thanks for watching. If you like that, please like and subscribe. Remember to have a wonderful day and peace out. Thanks for watching.